My beloved grandfather, Jack Jones, has left us after 95 years and four months. Pop counted the months, he was just like that. And he certainly made his time on Earth count. He was one of my greatest supporters and my daughters adored him. His favourite game involved stealing their pancakes when they weren't looking. He had the most incredible sweet tooth. They called him Old Pop. I got your nose. <laughs> no. Put it back again. As they grow up, I'll tell them about the wonderful life he led. Pop was a great storyteller. I loved hearing about the time he climbed on his roof in Ascot Vale to watch Farlap win the 1930 Melbourne Cup and how he met my nan at a dance, a stone's throw from Windy Hill and then asked to write to her while they went off to war. He missed games due to malaria when he got back. It's unbelievable, really. Stories about working as a butcher during the week and then wearing the red and black on the weekend. He once fell on top of his younger brother chasing a footy over the boundary at the MCG, back when fans were allowed to sit inside the fence. He was right next to John Coleman when the great full forward did his knee. Coleman telling Pop, I've got it, Jonah, as he flew in the marking contest. Pop was sentimental. He asked to wear the number 24 in honour of his battalion when he arrived at Windy Hill. And he loved that I, his first grandchild, was born on the 24th and got married on the 24th. He was the last to leave the dance floor at my wedding. On one of his final trips, he went to see his great-grandchild Willow's first day of school in Ascot Vale, across the road from the house he was born in, 90 years to the day after he started at the very same school. Pop was a gentleman. He was never late and never underdressed. Dermot Brereton used to tell me he reminded him of Cary Grant, dashing and distinguished. Pop loved the footy industry. He loved being fussed over by the staff at the Bombers and he loved ordering me to tell someone he said to say hello. No doubt he'll be glued to Fox footy in heaven. Pop was born in the Bombers heartland and he leaves us in Bombers heart.